say. Might I stand up for you, too? I mean, Barry doesn't know anybody in town, and he will need a best man. I say, that's very decent of you, Inspector. But only if it's all right with my future father-in-law. Why, I suppose it is. Now that it uh, maybe is exposing itself to her true colors, and turn it back on this fine man, I'm sure he's going to be thrown character. So therefore, I have no possibility of being assassinated, killed, or otherwise demised. And I therefore will let it go in. Oh, that's Edgar. not one. Oh, hey. Help! Edgar, we're alone. At last. Our plan worked perfectly. <laughs> plan? What plan? What are you talking about, Mrs.? I want to have my lover give me the gate so that you and I can live happily ever after. Why? You mean Don't to... you remember? You mean to tell me that you're not the evil murderer, so the one who I should turn over to the police, <laughs> have found over for trial, and yet publicly executed? you fired this gun at me? Knowing all along that it was a loaded with legs. But you put cyanide in the cocoa. It wasn't real cyanide. But the cat died. Darling, that was a stop cat. You just wanted to hear him, Constable Howard returned it. But that's an all I am, Constable Howard. Yes, yes, of course you are. You just didn't know it then. I told you right. I, yes. I forgot about my amnesia. Yes, amnesia makes it easy to forget. <laughs> And you say this was a plan between us, between you and I? Well, yes, of course. Oh, but that nasty old amnesia made you forget the whole thing. And here, I thought your darling, talking wife was really a, a mean old murderess. Can, can you ever forgive me for being so forgetful? Can't say that three times fast. No, no, dear. 